It's a beautiful morning today. It's it's great. It's great. We got up this morning. It's great. Good morning. I got my coffee making over there, and I just uploaded two videos to the to the to the tube. It's it's uploading right now. So let's see. Oh, this page is stuck. I gotta yeah anyway computer froze or something let me see nothing happened yeah, something, something's wrong with computer anyway i'm gonna restart it um let me restart it now so yeah um i just want to say thank you thank you thank you guys thank you for all the subscribers um I've seen a tremendous amount of subscribe subscribers since you know in the last past three days. I've been posting a lot more, posting you know shorts and posting my videos and stuff like that, mixing them in with other shorts. So I've been seeing a lot of um, traffic um, going through. Hold on one second, guys. Let me. Okay, we got it. I didn't have to restart the computer. I just refreshed it. Anyhow, you know, so thank you, thank you, thank you to all those subscribers. It says upload interrupted. Um, click resume. Okay. Let's see if we could resume this upload. Hold on one second, guys. Let me fix this real quick. Yeah, guys, so I fixed that. Um, the, the computer froze and then I had to just resume uploading. Let me check my text here. I'm getting a text at the same time. Give me a second. Yeah, guys. So, beautiful day. Thank you, thank you, thank you to the subscribers, as I said before. It's, you know, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Everybody clicking that subscribe button and, you know, getting on my channel. It's well appreciated. You know, it's a nice day today. It's, sun is coming out. We had a lot of rain last night, so the grass got a good amount of water. Um, let's see what's going on over there. Yeah, it's, it's wet. Over there is wet. It's, see, we got water on the furniture. But it came down real hard last night. <clears throat> Give us a good, nice soaking. So at least I don't have to worry about watering the grass, you know. But yeah, guys, um, it's early now. It's, it's probably about 7 o'clock, 7 a.m. I'm going to head over to the salon real quick just to give it a quick clean. I haven't worked on the ceiling yet. I got to go um, uh, insulate that ceiling and move the vent over. I'm going to probably do that later on tonight. Um, Saturdays, it's a busy day on Saturdays. It's kind of, you know, um, a lot of people in there. So I don't want to, you know, get in the way. I believe we have a daily rental today too so I can't really work in that room that I wanted to do the work in so I'll probably do it overnight when when everybody's gone so yeah um you know beautiful morning thanks again to all you guys who subscribe it is a life every day cha um, channel I pretty much get up and do what I do every day in life um, you know which is you know cleaning the salon making sure everything is good maintenance on the salon and i'm building a restaurant so all who just started watching this video that's what i'm doing it's just a simple life every day and what i get up and do every day it could be something that i'm just cutting my lawn i'm cleaning the trailer i'm you know cleaning this area right here making coffee um editing videos it could be anything anything that i get up and do in the morning time um anything i get up and do in the morning time uh, i'll show it to you throughout the day i'll show it to you um i don't do at nights um, i close off the video by a certain time because i end up have to edit these video videos so I, I cut it off at you know at a certain time every night um uh if you guys are watching i've been changing um 
my routine in terms of how I get sleep, what time I finish, um, what time I have my last meal, you know, how I eat. I've been, you know, including bits and pieces of that in the videos. So, as I said, it's just life every day. It could be anything. Um, I'm not expecting you guys to watch the whole thing, everything, all day. But sometimes you could just leave it playing. You could hear me talking in the background. Um, it might not be interested sometimes. It might be boring. It might be, you know what I'm saying? And then another time, it might be great. Um, some of you guys might say I talk a lot. <laughs> it is a talking channel, guys. It's what I do every day. I talk to you guys every day. I, I mix it in with what I have to do in a, in a daily life. Normally, if I'm not vlogging and I'm doing these things, I wouldn't be talking this much. So, um, it is what it is. It's a channel that I'm talking to you. Um, as I said, if I video what I'm doing every day without the talking, then you guys probably won't be interested, right? Or maybe I should try that, you know, do silent videos and just show what I'm doing, you know. But because it's a uh, live, I, I do limited editing when, I, when I'm doing this. What I'm talking to you right here, I'll put this whole thing in there um, without editing or taking anything out. Um, the only thing sometimes I'll take, you know, street signs and, and where I live or, or, you know, I might say one or two words. I don't want to put it out there, so I'll take that out. But for the most part, it's one take. Right now, we got four minutes, five minutes on this, and the whole thing is going to go in there. Um, I didn't make any mistakes, so I'm going to put the whole thing in there. Um, so, yeah, uh, it, it, it is because I haven't seen these little things right here. I don't know what it is. It's like something laid eggs like flies. It's up there on the fan. I don't know if you guys could tell me what it is. But it's on the fan. It's on the ceiling. I think it's like those little bugs or spiders or whatever. They lay eggs. See, it's right here again. They lay eggs. So later on today, I'm going to come and um, get the thing and clean all that stuff off. Clean the... Um, I got a lot of spiders back here. So I'm going to spray. I got the... Uh, pest control stuff I'm gonna spray back here a little bit um, there's a lot of creepy crawlers in the backyard as you can tell it's woods back there so um, I don't have any any kind of bugs or unwanted bugs or anything roaches we don't have any of those but we have a lot of spiders so it's like you would want to get rid of the spiders but get but guess what guys if you get rid of spiders then you're gonna have a lot of stuff flying around, right? Spiders play out. We, we went off into the animal channel now. So spiders catches all the little creepy crawlers and the flying stuff and the annoying little bugs that try to get in. When they set up webs, they actually catch those things, right? So it's a cycle, guys. If you get rid of spiders, you're gonna have more creepy crawlers crawling around. Um, the flying ones, at least. Um, you know, see how they, if you look over here, you got spider webs right here. But, as I said, if you take those webs down, what's going to happen is, you're going to have more things flying around and crawling around on the floor. And, you know, they catch these things. They That's what they eat. So, at the end of the day, you don't want to take everything down and spray it back here. And, you know, some people might say spray everything, but it's a cycle. You know what I'm saying? Without certain animals, you'll have certain <laughs> too much of the other animal. You know what I'm saying? Or insect in this case. But I'm making coffee. I'm gonna head out now. It's getting late, so I'm gonna head out now and um, go get the salon clean before it gets busy. Um, I made coffee this morning. So I got my coffee right there. Got the phone. I'm gonna head out the video is uploading so I'm just gonna leave that for it to upload to the tube and then head down to um oh it says upload complete so I'm gonna head over to um to the salon so stay tuned guys yeah guys so I'm done with the salon now um I cleaned um Cleaned the salon and got the um, that front room ready to go. The daily rental is good to go. They already in there. Um, the the front room, the move out, 
they they actually moved out mm, yesterday so i went and cleaned it up and i still have the baseboards i'm gonna paint the baseboards but i made it presentable because we have someone possibly taking a look at it today um they are gonna be you know seeing if it if it's a space works for them it, it that room is a kind of a small room it's only perfect for for um like a braider slash um barber like someone who just offer a one-on-one -on -one service in a chair um no reclining stuff beds or estheticians you know or maybe a makeup artist like a a, a one-on-one -on -one makeup artist where they don't have a large amount of people coming in it's just always one-on-one -on -one. that room is is kind of small um no wash bowls or anything in there so um i'm done with it i'm done with um with everything in there um they're in there right now taking a look at the space um speaking with the leasing agent so now i'm going to um probably head down because i need the mirror so tonight guys i have to come and do some work here tonight um one of the tenants they want a back splat uh, back wall uh, uh accent wall to be painted so i'm gonna paint i have that to paint maybe tomorrow night i have um the vent to move in that room but the reason why i can't move it is because the um the, the daily rental that's the daily rental room so someone is in there now so maybe tonight i'll come and work on that or tomorrow night um i'll do that um there's also the a, a larger room that's being rented where i put a wash bowl in there but i have to bolt it to the ground i have to secure it to the ground um these new wash bowls that we got um it it where you sit it's not supported it's it's like it's like this the edge of the seat right so if you sit on the edge of the seat it'll tip over so it's made for us to bolt the whole bolt the whole washbowl assembly to the ground if you don't then when you sit at the edge of the chair it'll, it'll tip over so i'm gonna get that bolted in um to to later tonight or tomorrow um, that room is the room i'm gonna get the mirrors for as well so i'm gonna buy the mirrors um and get those in the room um i think that person wants to start this wednesday so i'm gonna get the mirrors and everything put them in at least by tomorrow i didn't install the mirrors yet because i'm waiting on them to bring their barber chairs in when they bring the chairs in then we could know where to put the mirror um i didn't want to put the mirror in and then when you put the mirror in we're gonna have to move it you know what i'm saying so when they bring their chairs in and have them in the right space where they want it then we'll put the mirror to match the chair not the other way around because sometimes we put the mirror in when you put the chair it just doesn't work for them so they want us to move the mirror so you know i'll, I'll ha wait until they bring their barber chair in um they want to start this wednesday so hopefully today or tomorrow so i'm gonna get the mirrors um from now just in case it depends because if the if the traffic to go down there is crazy then I won't go and and yes guys thank you for the so um for the subscribe um subscribers have been hitting that button they've been hitting that button hitting that button over the past two days three days I've, I've gotten a lot of subscribers in the past two three days so thank you guys i'm over 300 now just just two weeks ago three weeks ago i was at, I was at like a hundred subscribers i know this is a little bit compared to the superstars of youtube but i'm grateful for just 300 guys thank you thank you thank you um i remember i was at 30 40 subscribers and saying man when i'm gonna reach at 100 now i blew past 100 blew past 200 now i'm over 300 i'm like 3 330 or something like that 340 as we speak um at the time of this recording but thank you very much guys i'm gonna look back on this video right here um when i passed that milestone of having 300 subscribers you know what i'm saying so thanks for being a part of this thanks for hitting that subscribe button um thank you thank you thank you thank you when you know i'm on the road to to a thousand um of course 
everybody who joins youtube would you know joins with the intention to to get monetized and make good content and keep you guys watching that's what i decided to do was do a life every day channel where you see my life every day and i could share that journey with you of you know not only getting a thousand subscribers but the journey of me doing what i'm doing every day with you know lifestyle and the journey of me starting a restaurant from scratch with zero you know with nothing you know what i'm saying so um thanks again guys for 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 staying tuned and and pressing that like that subscribe button please watch the videos so i could get some watch hours as well um so um i'm gonna head out to go get the um the mirrors i'm gonna check the let me check the um the look um so the place is at home the name of it is at home so let me see if there's any traffic to go down there if there's traffic i'll wait till later yep so there's traffic to go down there it's like 40 minutes just to go 15 minutes down the road so i'm not gonna join that line um where i'm at right now normally i would just jump on the highway right here and it takes like 15 minutes but according to this there's an accident so 85 is blocked up all the way so i wouldn't go on the, i wouldn't go now i'll probably just go later on today um and go go get grab those two mirrors um but yeah i'm done here at the salon um oh yeah guys i i, I tried out the live um for the first time i tried out um the 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 youtube live um for the first time i've never done it before but i've tried i tried it for about nine minutes ten minutes a while ago and um you know I'm gonna post that live later on today I had to cut it short because I got a phone call I had a phone call came in and I cut that that live short but um pretty much it, you know I was just testing it I had actually had six people on the live at one point you know so thank you for those who guys who actually joined the live I didn't have much to say um, I was just testing it I wanted to just see what it looks like in terms of um you know see what it looks like right there you know I'm looking at myself so you know I wanted to just see what it looks like in terms of um, the buttons and you know what what should I press you know you know it has a mute mute button how to flip the screen I was just checking to see how that works um, you know in terms of a, a live um, I've, I've just never done it before I've never hit that button to, to do live so I tried it and I actually had six person came on the live. I, I'm quite sure it would have gone up some more if I stayed on it. But an, an important call came in and I had to end the live. So, um, yeah, um, pretty much it, it's, it's, you know, it's getting more and more addictive as we go along, guys. I've never done that before. So, you know, thank you to those six person. I appreciate every single person that actually tune in to, to any of this. You know what I'm saying? So um thank you thank you thank you you know thank you guys i can't wait for you guys to start you know talking posting stuff on the live so i could you know i could actually talk back you know i've seen people doing live i saw i see my uh colors and all them and all the people my the, my favorite youtubers do it and um you know i i pretty much you know um you know text them all the time and they reply and they answer back and they they speak back to when you text them so hopefully one day i could get to that as well um but yeah i'm here in the parking lot right now i'm still in the salon parking lot as you can see it's getting filled the restaurants are opened up now so um, this is the back parking lot it's gonna get crowded later on once everyone is open so we got three major restaurants in here we have a uh, the big ones is is is, is uh, Marlowe's Tavern, Just Brunch that does breakfast. They closes at four. They close at four, and then we have a a, a new uh, I can't call it guys. A Mexican restaurant, La La Vueda Vueda La Vueda. I, I I don't know how to call it. I don't speak Spanish, so you know that's 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 the restaurant so it's a third restaurant that open and they're all dining with bars and stuff like that so they tend to bring a lot of dining customers 
dine-in customers. So the parking lot gets filled by lunchtime. You know what I'm saying? Lunch 12 1, especially on a Sunday, it's it's filled over here. No, no parking here. We have to use an, an alternate parking that, that's up up on the top up there by the bank. So um this is where I'm at. Um lifestyle is right between two restaurants. So we have we're between Firehouse Sub and Marlowe's Tavern. Um that's where the salon suite is. Um, it's a very busy parking lot. Um, or if any anyone lives here in, in the USA, United States, Georgia, um, in the Duluth area and in that profession who needs a space to operate and do business, that's what we do. Um, I keep saying lifestyle salon suite, but I don't explain what we do. So we're, we're a salon suite where we have individual spaces that we we rent to individual professionals so you have a lot of people who do hair barbers um eyelashes uh, eyebrow uh facials estheticians all those people we provide a space where they could have their own suite slash room that that they could provide these services right um uh when they rent a space from us they they actually have access to their own suite with their own code their own door their you know like their own key to their own space um it is an individual business so you're not working for us you're working for yourself you're actually registering a business with the city um um to to provide those services right um, so that's your own business. We have nothing to do with it. All we do is just rent you a space to provide your services to your customers. So you could provide your services to your customers. So that's what a salon suite is. Um, so I, we, we, you know, provide that space so that they could, you know, do what they got to do to make, to make money or, or do business. Um, so, you know, here's a barber, one of our barbers driving in right now. Um, so he's one of the barber in the front. Um, we have another barber right here. We have um, we have we have a couple of barbers. We have like three or four barbers in there. Um, uh, we have a hairstylist. We have um, a makeup artist. We have uh, hair braiders that's in there. We have a like a body contouring, body sculpting person in there that does they don't do massages they do uh body contouring or 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 therapy you know when you get a surgery or something like that they they you know do that um so that's what we provide we just provide a space so that that our tenants can do business and 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 it's a 24 hour operation so our doors are open 24 hours they don't have to open 24 hours but they have access 24 hours so they could come in and 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 do what they gotta do whatever time they feel like they could come in at two in the morning three in the morning some of the bar barbers they work late night um, um, I'll see them there one to two in the morning um, cutting here so they'll have a client and the client will pay more and they come in and knock it out you know what I'm saying so you know our facility is 24 hours the lights go out at a certain time the AC temperature goes up at a certain time so we turn the AC off at a certain time at, at the night um, and the lights go out but the we have a, a night lights so sconce lights that turn turn on at night at, so after eight o'clock those dimmed lights come on um so they could still enter the building and see and there's lights in the hallway but it's not those real bright lights it's, it's like a dimmed light that comes on at nights in the hallway but everything works we have motion lights so like the lights in the bathroom the lights in the hallway to the bathroom those lights light up once you walk in there so it goes out and goes dim but once you enter in there it, it turns on um, in the daytime it just stays on so um, 
once again it's it's a 24-hour facility for our tenants and the tenants customers um, you could enter so that's the advantage of of renting a suite to do business versus working in a salon when you work in a salon that salon closes by a certain time open by a certain time and then some days they're closed so some salon suites are not salon suite but a salon is actually closed on a sunday so even if you rented a space or a booth in that salon you can't take a customer on sundays you see what i'm saying you can't take a customer after a certain time in every evening but with a salon suite you have access to that place 24 7. you could work every single day if you want you could work overnight if you want so let's say you have a day job you could work a day job and come to your business at nights and take clients at nights or evening time you know what i'm saying let's say you have a morning job you could work in the morning and take clients in the evening time so it's flexible so that's the advantage the main advantage of renting a salon suite to do business you have access 24 hours a day um it's pretty safe this this parking lot is 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 safe this area is safe um not saying that things don't happen no guys but for the most part this is a safe area um on the um the doors there's no access you can't just walk in our doors are always closed um, we have um door entry systems so only the persons who are coming to you are allowed to come in you know what i'm saying so when they come in they ring your room um and then whoever is in that room they could let them in or don't answer it or speak to them see them you could see them we have a, a intercom a video intercom that's in every room so once you're in that room and you have a client coming to you you could see if it's your client and buzz them in um, so we have all the you know the security features um, already installed we have um, a camera system so we could cover the, from the front door to the back door outside inside um, so we could see who's actually coming in and coming out we also have um, uh, we have access to see which tenant came in through what door so we're able to see if the barber came in at 2 uh, when did he leave when did he come you know what I'm saying so we have we have access to all of that we could see all of that um, so yeah um, that's basically what the salon suite is um, and that's why we have to come here every day to, to, to make sure everything is running smooth there's no pipes leaking there is no you know issues with any equipment failure water leaks water pipes leaking you know make sure bathrooms are always clean we always want the, this place to be in tip-top shape in terms of cleanliness um, it has to be clean we 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 want it to look like you know it's it's top tier every you know every day all day you know what i'm saying so sometimes we clean sometimes we clean the 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 bathrooms two three times a day you know what i'm saying the kiosks the front door all that stuff gets cleaned once twice maybe three times depending on how busy they are so yeah um I'm gonna close this little segment out. I've been talking for like 18 minutes, guys. So give me a, you know, give me a few. I'm gonna head back over. Um, I'm probably gonna go over to the house and uh, pick up the insulation so I could insulate those rooms. I can't do it right now because there is someone in there occupying the room at this point. So I'll probably do it tomorrow night. If they don't take it tomorrow, I'll do it overnight in the night time. So yeah. Um, stay tuned guys the day is going good it's now uh probably about 12 o'clock i'm gonna get something to eat shortly and then um go from there uh, stay tuned but guys it's a saturday and it's filled with traffic Look, we got traffic here traffic up on the highway there's traffic everywhere the highway is blocked up Look, everybody trying to get off the highway because it's blocked up the overpass up there is filled with traffic, standstill traffic. It's Georgia for you guys. Georgia traffic. Yeah, 
left the salon guys I left the salon I'm heading home heading home chill out a little bit until the traffic cools down and then I'm gonna head um, to get the mirrors this guy in front of me driving still I gotta move change lanes oh he on the phone so yeah so yeah man me try out the live the youtube live did a little 10 minute live there um i'm gonna post it later on i didn't post it i got cut off because the um i got cut off because the, the the i got a call a phone call came in and i had to stop the live but next time um when i'm doing a live i'm just gonna silent the phone that way it doesn't ring you know But yeah Stay tuned guys I'm on the road I'm, I'm heading home Yeah It's like a hurricane coming. Check this out. It's about to be raining. Yeah, yeah guys. It's I know some trees are gonna be falling today. Should have moved the fan. I was parked, parked under a tree over there. Yeah guys, give me a second, I'm gonna move the van. Cause I'm parked under a tree and those limbs, they fall off real easy. The tree, it's a huge tree, so them branches are always falling off. So, give me a second guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move the van in a minute. Give me a second. Alright guys, so I moved up Smokey. It's, it's about to be storming guys, storming. Ah, look, the wind is blowing hard. It's, yeah, so what I did, I moved the truck Smokey up a little bit. You notice there's a big tree right there, them limbs are always falling off. So I didn't want it to fall in the glass. So I moved it over. It looks like it's under the tree, but it's not. It's out in the open now. So, in that tree, it doesn't look safe. It looks lean like it wants to fall over. I don't like parking stuff over there. Even this trailer. There's some tall trees right there, but those trees are nice and solid. I don't think they're gonna fall. But this one right here. Guys, yeah, just the tree going in <laughs> gonna have to close the door <sighs> all right yeah so i think it's i'm gonna close this vlog off um right now uh, there's nothing else um i was gonna go back to the salon tonight but um i'll probably just go tomorrow morning early and get some work done um i couldn't get anything else done inside there because of the um with the daily rental the room i was working on was actually the daily rental so we had a a last minute daily rental today um they they just pretty much took it last night so i was planning on going there today and do the work today but you know we ain't gonna give up a daily rental so they did what they had to do today um tomorrow hopefully they don't take it tomorrow if they don't take it tomorrow then i'll i'll do the work that i need to do um tomorrow but um i think that's gonna be it guys again thank you for all the subscribers you guys are amazing thanks for hitting that button um you know i'm gonna keep pushing out content as much as content you know life every day stuff that i do in my life every day i'm gonna keep putting stuff out 
um, keep posting my shorts um, you know so I appreciate you guys you know really um, I appreciate you guys really tuning in and subscribing to the channel so I appreciate you guys thank you very much be safe out here have a good one I'll see you in the morning <laughs>